The question is why? Is it because I'm a genius? No, it's because I did the right things. So what I believe in is that you have to do things in a smart way. So Nareen is asking if someone wants to learn five languages, how to start, how to believe in yourself, how to do it. Hmm. Good question. Language learning. Okay. First of all, if you want to learn five languages, you have to start with one. <laughs> all right. That's it. You know, it's good to have a goal of learning five languages, but start with one. Pick a language that you're really excited about and do it in a smart way. Do it in a smart way. I'll give you an example of Spanish. Okay. So when I learned Spanish, it took me one month, one month to go from pretty much zero, being able to say, hi, how are you? Goodbye. Basic stuff to have a proper conversation it took me one month. The question is why? Is it because I'm a genius? No, it's because I did the right things. So what I believe in is that you have to do things in a smart way. So there is something called cognates. Cognates are words that are similar in English and other languages. So for example, in English you say possible, in Spanish you say possible, but in Italian you say possibile. In Portuguese, you say possível. So I could give you a bunch of different examples, but but um, the point is there are words that are similar in different languages. So you want to find a list of those words that are similar in English and the language that you want to learn, and you want to first learn that list because you already know those words. You just have to realize that you know them. The pronunciation may be a bit different, uh, but the spelling is almost the same, okay? Another thing is the frequency lists. You want to learn the most frequent words used in a language, right? You don't just want to learn every single word. No, you want to identify 500, 1000 most frequent words. And if you learn them, guess what? You can communicate. People don't realize that. And finally, you want to practice from day one. You really want to practice from day one. There's a guy called uh, Benny Lewis, I believe. Uh, he has a website, Fluent in Free Months. But Benny Lewis, great guy. I never met him, but I, I, I really enjoyed his content back in the day. So he always says that you gotta speak from day one. What he does, and I like it a lot, is even if he just knows a couple of sentences, he would start speaking to people. And I do exactly the same thing. You know, when I was learning Portuguese, I went to Brazil and I would just talk to people. I talked to strangers. When I was on a, on a plane to Brazil, I had a list of words and I had two young people sitting next to me and I told them, hey, uh, oi, bom dia, tudo bom. And I said, listen, I want to learn Portuguese. And they said, perfect, we can teach you. We have a long flight and a lot of wine. So that's exactly what we did. We were drinking wine and speaking Portuguese and I learned so much. So you got to practice. And just like with anything in life, it can get uncomfortable, right? People feel uncomfortable practicing because people don't want to make mistakes. A lot of people don't. Actually, most people don't want to make mistakes. We are afraid of sounding stupid. We are afraid of making mistakes. But you got to realize that anything you want to learn in life, you got to make mistakes. If you don't make mistakes, it means that you're not trying, you're not learning. So even though we are talking about language learning, this applies to any realm of life. Anything you want to learn, anything you want to do, any business you want to set up, you have to just go out there and do the damn thing and then you learn from your mistakes, okay? And that's how you learn the fastest. Because otherwise, if you always careful if you're always thinking if you are just waiting for the perfect moment if you're just waiting for the moment when everything is going to be fine you have zero practice and the only way to get better is by practicing okay so whatever it is that you want to learn you got to practice and practice and practice